All right, in this video, I'm gonna show you a setup I created for using a Chromebox as a video conferencing station. So you'll see over here, we have a monitor that is hooked up to a, or mounted on a rolling cart. And um, there's a tray here, and we have a Chromebox, a couple of webcams, and down here we have a mic and a, and a speaker combo. And then we have a mouse, wireless mouse, and a wireless keyboard. So just to break down what's going on here, so we have a Samsung 50 inch, monitor here. Um, you'll see it's mounted onto this peerless stand and here we have an HDMI cable coming down that'll go into the Chrome box and over here we have the power and that goes down. We'll talk about power in a second. So let's follow the HDMI cable. So this goes down to our Chrome box. Our Chrome box is an ASUS Chrome box and you'll see HDMI is coming out here. Back in the back we have two USB outputs that go to our two webcams that we'll talk about in just a second. And then out front we have a um, USB, I guess it's a dongle here for our, our USB plug for our um, uh, wireless mouse and wireless keyboard. And then we have a USB extender that goes out to the Jabra wireless mic and speaker combo. So this mic, this mic and speaker combo is nice for video conferencing station because as people are sitting around this table, they could all control um, control volume and control um, the, the microphone from here so they have power or sorry they have volume settings they can adjust and they can mute it if they need to. Um, we're just using a standard Windows wireless mouse and keyboard right now. Soon there should be a wireless Chrome keyboard on the market but that has yet to arrive. Um, now if we look up here I'm running a Google Hangout so you can see me um, up there. Now I'm going to go and look at the webcams right now. So I'm going to click on settings. Right now we're using a um, Genius Wide Throw 1080p webcam. And the reason that we're using this one is it gives us a um, really wide um, horizontal range on our, on our, on our video here. Um, now I'm going to switch to the other webcam to show you the alternative. So the other webcam is a HD Pro webcam. C920 from Logitech, which are really good webcams. They're high quality, but you'll notice that it has a standard width, and so um, we don't see as far around the table. So I'm going to switch back again to the other just to show you the difference. So here we have quite a bit difference. So it seems like we could fit at least another person around the table on each side with the with the wide throw. Um, so this is our setup. You'll, uh, a couple things to note. Um, when I hooked up the wireless mouse and keyboard, I had to put the plug in the front because when I put it in the back, um, my, my range wasn't as high. Um, also, regarding power, there are a couple options here, and I have two power, uh, power situations here that I'll explain. The first is a simple um, um, it's a Kensington power outlet. It's plugged in. It has a long... Um, has a long uh, cable on it. I have it wrapped around a couple times here, but so you could get probably a good 20 feet uh, from this. Now the other option here is a little bit more pricey, but it's actually but it's kind of interesting, so I wanted to play with it. This is an uninterruptible power supply that's typically used like on a server s setup, um, but the nice thing about this is it's battery powered, so um, if we're not near an outlet, we can still run um, our Chromebox video conferencing station. And because both the Chromebox and the Samsung display pulls so little power, this can actually go for a long time. So I've actually had this running for about 30 minutes now, and you'll see that it says it has about 25 minutes left to go before it's out of power. Um, so that's, that's pretty cool, I think. And um, it gives us even more flexibility so that we can, we can take this thing anywhere, and we can set it up to any table and create a video, video conferencing station with ease.